Welcome back to the show. I'm Rachel Gilbert. From X-Men to Spider-Man and everything in between, LA Mood and Comics, Mood Comics and Games has been entertaining Londoners by providing comic books for over 15 years. And now Carol Vandenberg joins me in studio to tell us all about it. Hi, Carol. Hi. Thanks for coming in today. I, I got the name wrong there. It's LA Mood. Comics and games. That's correct. So I apologize. No problem. <laughs> it's so a mouthful. You, yeah, so you sell everything and you've been going for 15 years. So mm -hmm. let's talk about your business and sure. why you started, first of all. Well, I got into it because of my husband. He, okay. he and his father started the business. Uh, he, my father in law, uh, sold stamps and then okay. my, they wanted to open a store to sell stamps and um, my husband wanted to sell comics, so they tried to sell both, but mm -hmm. eventually the comics were much more popular than <laughs> stamp collecting. <laughs> yes, exactly. So, and then eventually I got involved, and my husband and I took it over 10 years ago. Okay. Or no, yeah, almost 10 years ago. 10 years yes, ago. Yeah. So, you, But you've been open for 15, 15 years. Under and you have, you have games, too, now, yeah, too. Yeah. So you've added more. Yes, actually. Okay. Yes, we keep expanding, so we had to keep moving. Yeah. <laughs> so now, what kind of comics do you have? Do you have any special ones that people are people search for to, to get, or, oh. or what do you sell? Well, we, we sell new issue comics, okay. and we sell back issue comics, uh, uh, more recent back issues, as well as the old collector stuff as well. Okay. Like, uh, you know, uh, the Spider-Man number one, if we could, uh, but yeah. it, you know, is that, that that's a big one. Oh yeah, they're, yeah, they're expensive. If we could oh have that, that would be nice. <laughs> yeah, can you get those? Do Sometimes. You trade for those, uh, well, no. Usually, you can you get collectors who bring in collections who want you to buy their oh, stuff, okay. or you know, uh, sometimes we do some of the uh, more expensive comics. Sometimes they're on consignment, um, but you know, it, it, there are various ways to get yeah. those comics. But you can't. There's not a distributor that sells old comics. Yeah, the, so this those, is like a collector's haven. Yeah, yeah, we yeah. try. Yeah. <laughs> Now you've got some games here, and you brought um, some comics in too. Yes. Let's talk about the games that we have here. Sure. Which one do you want to start with? This big one here. Well, Settlers of Catan is um, a board game. It's a very popular game in Germany, but it's now come over to North America. Okay. It, it was our best-selling game at Christmas time. It's oh. very fun for the whole family. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So. Why is it? Why do people like well, it? Well, it's Monopoly? it's it's similar to Monopoly oh, okay. uh, in in that it's a great family game, but it's mm. based on production. If you uh, you get uh, the production from the land you're settling uh, you're settling an island of Catan oh. and you get the production and you can build roads cities and stuff like that just like in yeah. monopoly when you get the three you places the you and yes yeah. exactly it's a similar concept but you know more on a settlers level <laughs> so these are games that they don't we don't have anywhere else are these pretty original games that, that you have at the store well we're one of the few places that sells uh, settlers of Catan there are yeah. other places that do sell it but uh, yeah. it was our most popular for you're Christmas. one of the select few yes that's yes right. <laughs> All right, so now what is this one? This is Star Wars uh, this collectible? Is, it's a collectible miniatures game. Okay. And what it is is you, you collect all the little figures from the, from the Star Wars world, mm -hmm. and you can build, each player builds a team of these, and they can fight each other oh, okay. on a battle on the tabletop, so, yeah. so to speak. So yes. do the kids really like that? They then? like that. Yeah. These are collectible. Uh, they're called collectors because you get a random, you get seven random figures in a, in a pack, and in this one? Yeah. There's oh. seven random figures. They're, okay. little, they're small, similar to, to oh, these. Okay. Okay. Only these ones are hero clicks based on, on superheroes. Similar okay. idea, but these ones are based on, on superheroes. These are based on now, Star Wars. Now, these are so tiny that they look like game pieces. Well, that's this it. This is you play a miniatures game oh, on okay. the table. You build a... They have Duh, a certain... Stupid yeah. me. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay. Well, it's new, and it's very hot. We actually have... Okay. Uh, Hero Clicks uh, tournaments every Saturday. Oh, at the store. Yeah, at the store. Yeah. So you have people come in yes. and play games there. Yeah, exactly. Oh, what and other games do people come in and do? Uh, we do Magic: The Gathering, which is a card game. It's uh, a similar concept to, uh, as to Dungeons and Dragons and, and okay. Lord of the Rings. You're you're casting spells and stuff like this. Mm -hmm. And again, there's tournaments. So uh, we have uh, Friday Night Magic, we call it. And, okay. And people come on Fridays and they play Magic: The Gathering. Very down cool. At our store, so. so anybody can come and, and just drop in and do that, or do they? Yeah. Need uh, no, they don't need to sign up. Uh, they can just drop in. We have uh, uh, our employees that run the games are very knowledgeable, can help you get started if you don't know how to play. But mm -hmm. the pl some of the players are, are very good. So, <laughs> <laughs> Well, you'll have to get your skills up then yeah, if, you, exactly. if you'll go. It'll yeah. get, but get it'll get you started and, and new people. 
people are always welcome. Yeah, okay. Now, what's this one here? That's the Hero Clicks one. That's the okay. one based on the superheroes. So okay. it's, they're similar ideas, but uh, two different companies, two different licenses, basically. Okay, so, so these aren't these just, are, you know, you can play games with these. They're not yeah. just. That's right. You can collect them because up. they're so cool, yes. <laughs> or you can play the game. Yeah. So that's it. Now, yeah. you mentioned that your husband loved comics. Oh, yes. um, Did you like comics when you met him when you started the store? Or I have you grew to love them. This? Yeah. <laughs> He, he was more into comics when I, I met him. I, mm -hmm. I as, as a girl, didn't read that many comics when mm -hmm. I was a, a, a little girl or anything. So I, I, I've grown to enjoy them, that's and for sure. What are, your, what are some of your favorites? Um, well, currently I'm reading uh, Civil War, okay. uh, which is uh, the, here, show you. Yeah, <laughs> Civil there, War. Yeah. It's uh, the, from Marvel Comics. It's a big, huge event where um, this, in the Marvel Universe, um, sorry. That's okay. Uh, they it looks kind of like a, this looks like more of a novel than, the, than a... Well, that's part six. It's supposed okay. to be seven parts, but oh, uh, basically they, the government has decided that they're going to register all superheroes and mutants because they're dangerous to society. So mm -hmm. that has created a, a rift between the superhero community. Mm -hmm. Some are for registration, some are against. It's very, it's very topical. Uh, I, it appeals to an older crowd very yeah. much, uh, like the late teens and over, um, because, you know, the war and stuff yeah. like that, it's very, mm -hmm. um, you know, exciting. Adva more advanced. Yeah, yeah like exactly. Do you find that more, I'll just put this down so sure. we're not blocked anymore. Do you find sure. that more um, adults are into comics now, or is it kind of a passion that stays with them since they were kids, or? Well, certainly it stays with them, I think, if yeah. they were into it when they are kids. A lot yeah. of them, are, they still have a fond spot for it when mm -hmm. they get older. Uh, le I think the teenage years are when they're they're actually getting into comics and the, and even in the universities university students because okay. they're a, so they're aimed at a lot older crowd now than they oh, used okay. to be the, and that's partly the way they're sold um, comics were sold at the at the corner store yeah. and now they're not sold as much at the corner store they're yeah. sold in a specialty shop like ourselves and yeah. so we're not right next door to their ha the parents house and the exactly. kids aren't just coming downtown to buy the comics yeah. so it's an older crowd now yeah. but we're getting parents who bringing their kids in to buy comics or to play hero clips to play the games yes, and exactly. things like that yes exactly so they're coming back and getting their kids into it too is the game, is getting together to play these games, is that a new thing or has I, that been going on for a while? I think, well, I think it, there's been a, a, a growth of it here in London for sure. I don't think it's a, necessarily a new thing, but there's new trends to it, like the, the miniatures is a, a new trend. Mm -hmm. um, and the board games are coming back, yeah. I think. So it's Friday and Saturday you have it downtown. Yep. Okay. That's correct. How's business going? Good? Oh, good. It's fun. Yeah. 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 Lots, of, lots of comic books being sold. Oh, yeah, yeah for yeah. sure. Absolutely. Good. Okay. Tell us where you're located. If we want to get a hold of you, how can we do that, too? Okay. We're located at 350 Richmond Street. That's between York and King Street downtown. Okay. Um, parking is available on King Street or at, you know, the market and yeah. Galleria. Um, you can call us at 519-432-3987 or we have a blog. It's oh, okay. uh, www.lamoodcomics.blogspot.com. Uh, yes, that's very advanced of you <laughs> I know. to have a blog. Well, it's a lot I don't easier. Even have a blog. <laughs> it's a lot easier than a web page. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. That's right. Okay, well, thanks for coming oh, in today, Carol. Thank and you thanks very much. for bringing all this stuff. Hey, no problem. And good luck. Thanks. All right, we'll be right back after this uh, to wrap up the show. Stay with us.